Fellow bad guys, it is with great pain that I give you this speech in front of my Nazi podium. Sadly, despite our best efforts, the good guy is still alive, and so we must invade his planet and whittle down his health bar once and for all. We will fight him in the courtyards. We will fight him in the sci-fi hallways. We will fight him in an empty parking lot with a bunch of shipping containers in it for some reason. The good guy will not escape us this time. And just like that, another Halo killer steps up to the plate. The reason this looks so nice is because I'm playing it on PS3 with the Killzone Remastered in HD with Trophy Support Edition. Introducing the new Orange Scope. It doesn't actually give you heat vision, it just turns things orange. It's kind of cool though, I guess, if you want to pretend you're playing the game Haze. I like how the scope isn't like centered, like you can kind of go, oh, oh, oh. That feels like a PlayStation Move feature. I don't think that Killzone 1 has PlayStation Move though. Killzone 3 has move support and gyro aiming if you're feeling a especially gamer. Don't threaten me with a good time. Like, favor, subscribe if you want me to play Killzone 3 with gyro aiming only. I'll do it. You've earned a trophy burn, baby burn. Oh yeah. Do you prefer Xbox achievements or PlayStation trophies? Let me know in the comments. Honestly, I prefer achievements because the sound is better. The little the sound it makes. It's a good sound. Oh, it got green. Whoa, there's grass in this game? No way. Having green grass in your FPS makes it instantly better than like 95% of games. Oh, I sure am parched after that battle. Thanks, water cooler. I owe you one. All right. Oh, whew, man. I am really thirsty after walking two feet. Ah, oh, thanks, water core. Delicious. This is the most hydrated office I've ever seen. This whole game has like compressed N64 sounds, except for the water bottle sounds really good for some reason. That was somebody's passion project right there. Behold the crumbling memorial. What is this a memorial to? Here lies the Halo franchise killed by Killzone. Wow, they're really confident in this one, huh? Why am I using one of the paintball pistols from Community when I could be using the super duper pistol? It holds one round because that's all you need. Come here, Hellgast. Prepare to be targeted by my really strange crosshair. Die. Oh, it's a grenade. Pretty good grenade too. Good glass physics as well. Maybe this game can kill Halo. In the future, computer screens will be transparent. I don't know why everybody thought that because it's, it's pretty obviously a terrible idea. Intact soda machines. We got the Sparky Bars. Fizzed. Oh, they're fizzed now. Cool. And the Kiwi Smoothie. I gotta go with the Sparky Bars because they're fizzed. Fizzed is better. This game's so advanced, they even got plants in the sci-fi hallway. Eat your heart out, Master Chief. Halo and Killzone duped it out for many years, but at the end of the day, only one of them is in Fortnite. So who's the real winner? I'm seriously asking. I can't tell. There's a new season of Infinite. Hop on, bro. They added the DMR to Infinite. Do your, uh, do your login. Some Microsoft executive, like, went home and played Halo Reach and looked at the armor customization and was like, oh, he was just sitting there drooling, scrolling through 500 different shoulder pads. He, he saw like a, he saw 499 next to each shoulder pad. He's like, imagine, imagine if we could just sell all these pieces for money. Spaz 12 test. How good is it? Ugh. That's not the greatest animation sound effect combo I've seen. No, 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 no. It sucks. Didn't even kill those guys. Failed. Yeah, you failed. You failed to make your shotgun good. You've earned a trophy. Elite? Elites are for Halo. We don't need elites in Killzone. You shoot people in Killzone, not stupid aliens with fake purple blood. Killzone's a hardcore game with red blood, where real people go, when you shoot them. New character unlocked, Splinter Cell. Oh, I got the suppressed SMG on this one. I like this character. This is the character for me. Oh, I got a knife as well. Dude, this is like the exact knife when you kill General Shepard in Modern Warfare. She's got soaps, gloves, and everything. Heat vision. Whoa, this character, dude, the, the first guy sucked. Why would you ever be that guy when this character exists? This Killzone game's not very scary at all. Roar! Ah! Oh, it was just graffiti. I hate to give you two L's in a row, Kiwi Smoothie, but Rezzy's just sounds better. Kiwi Smoothie's not a very creative name. Yeah, I can see how this could kill Halo. Why did the hell gas have to invade the Cherry Blossom Park? This is where I keep all my Lego pink frogs. The most advanced AI in gaming. What? What's happening? All right, kill zone. RIP Halo, am I right? Hey guys, it's me, the new character Rico. Uh, do you know why I'm transparent on the loading screen? Is this some kind of like purgatory or something? Or feel the fury of Rico? Okay, Rico's pretty good. Who do you like better, Rico from Killzone or Rico Harbor from Super Mario Sunshine? One has a machine gun that kills the hell gas really fast, but the other one has blooper raising. Overall, Rico from Killzones, he's a pretty good character, but his main downside is his gloves do not resemble the gloves that Soap McTavish has in Modern Warfare 2 during several missions, so I cannot give him the best Rico award. This stupid 
stupid game thought that in the future there would still be shopping malls. Ironically, I ordered this copy of Killzone 1 HD off of Amazon. How many GameStops were in your local mall? I had two. That's right, two GameStop retail locations. Literally a one minute walk away from each other. Man, I can't believe that company's not doing well. Man, whenever I go grocery shopping, I only want buns and nothing else, but there's all this other stuff in the way, like there's eggs and milk and cereal, and I, I don't want that stuff. I just want buns. If only there was a store for me. Oh, humbug. Somebody just graffitied humbug. I feel you, buddy. I get it. What do you guys want from Planet Yummy? They have the hamburger, they have the fries, they have the pizza, and they have, ah, oh, salad. Come on. What is Planet Yummy Burger Invasion doing selling a salad? If I want a salad, I'll just go to Benito's. Oh my God, all three machines at once. Here we go, the ultimate tier list. Uh, bottom tier is Kiwi for sure. Middle tier is that one and Sparky Bar is the best. And with that, the Kill Zone 1 beverage tier list was complete. Hey, did you try that new restaurant in the mall called Laurel? Laurel? What do you mean, Laurel? Yeah, the, the new the new restaurant right by Miu. There's no restaurant called Laurel by Miu. Yeah, there is. It just opened up, dude. Oh, you, you're talking about Yanny? Half Helgast, half human. <laughs> I don't want to f***ing imagine how that works. Well, when Helgast and a human love each other very much, eat lead Helgast scum, uh, I mean, eat ice cream heck gast scum. Right, Susan? Don't want to get the It's not even Susan, though. It's Neil now. Cursing the name of Susan is so inscribed within YouTuber vocabulary. It's gonna take a while for us to change over to Neil Mohan. I say we all just keep blaming Susan. That works for me, what do you guys think? Blame Susan for something bad that happened to you in the comments section. Listen up, soldier, we have to defend this area to the last man. If it costs 100 good guy lives for every inch of ground the Hellgans take, then that's a deal I'm willing to trade for. Uh, no offense, sir, but is this place really worth defending? What do you mean, soldier? Of course it's worth defending. Uh, I don't know, it just seems like it's a Rusty Shack. Not really sure why the Hellgans are invading this area with 500 troops. Sir, we've secured the Rusty Shack. Excellent. That shack is the last piece we need for our evil plan. New character unlocked. Hacka. Hopefully he can like hack a door and open it. Otherwise his parents named him wrong. I feel bad for all those kids who are named Dovahkiin who will never grow up to be a dragonborn. And all those little girls named Khaleesi who no matter what they do will always have a worse story than Bran the Broken. I need to hack into the mainframe. Ah, hack into the mainframe. I see. Yes, that makes sense computer stuff. Hacka's loadout is the normal gun, that sucks. The pistol, it's kind of good, and a knife, okay. Hacka is a hack, what a trash character. He's the last one you unlock and he has the lamest guns ever. Is this game more fun than watching Family Guy funny moments? I'm gonna go with no, because some of those Family Guy funny moments are pretty funny. Like when Carter Pewterschmidt rearranges his furniture, that's hilarious. Yep, I got no idea where to go, that's good. What's my objective? Reach the point, okay, not helpful at all. Display cake, uh, okay, here you go, I guess. Reluctantly crouched at the starting line. This area looks nice, look how green the cutscene is. We're about to be in the Oblivion Forest. Oh, never mind, it's a gray swamp. I should have known. I gotta get a better ENB. Humidity's killing me. Oh, grow up, baby. The Hellgast have to fight in the jungle too, and they wear full power armor with a helmet that makes them sound like this. If they can handle the humidity, you can too. Are you there? Oh, Hellgast, hello. I have very low health, I'm scared. I'm scared to fight them and redo all this. Oh god. No, 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 no. Let me move, bamboo, bamboo, no! Aw. Failed, yeah, you failed. You failed to make a good game, but yeah, I'm I'm the failure, sure. Back at the beginning of the mission? Are you joking me? There was no checkpoint that whole time? What frag? I love that frag I could see and avoid because it landed in water so I couldn't see where it was. That was good, that was good, that was good, that was good. Humidity's killing me. Yeah, the grenade guy is killing me, but the humidity, man, it's pretty bad. Checkpoint, please. Uh, waiter, I'll take a checkpoint, please. Can we get a, can we get a split checkpoint? I'm gonna pay for the gunplay that I ordered, but somebody else has to pay for that grenade guy because I didn't order him. The swamp biome's a real drain on creativity and fun and joy and happiness. Everything that makes life worth living is not present in the kill zone one swamp section. Hey, do you guys wanna go attack the grenade guy around the corner? Oh uh, no, that's okay, you can do it. Okay, I'll go do it myself, I guess. Gotta be very careful. And I'm dead. Oh boy, this game is wearing me down. I don't know if I have it in me to finish this one. Cause in this like stream level, you go around the corner, there's a grenade guy. He shoots, you shoot, maybe you kill him. He probably kills you. Then if you don't die, you have one health. Then you go around the next corner and there's another grenade guy and he'll kill you for sure. And then when you die, you get to restart all the way back at the beginning. We got some help, guys. Watch out. 
Oh my god. Wow, that was fun. Thanks, Killzone, for giving me a fair chance to react to that grenade. Yeah, give me give me a trophy for that as well. Great. Alright, I think I'm think I'm done Killzone 1 for now. Maybe permanently, but I might watch the ending cutscene sometime. For a 2005 PlayStation 2 game, it's not that bad. By modern standards, yeah, obviously it's horrible. But for, for a time it came out, it's uh, not the worst thing. There's worse games out. Maybe Killzone 2 will be the Halo killer.